Jamal Nias here with the main man, Nathan Kelly. Just a night away now from your return to the three arena here in Dublin. Looking to continue that vicious win streak going. One, one of the best in Bellator at the moment. How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling pumped now after I stared me a pound in the eyes and, and, and you know, looking him, looking him, looking him down the, down the straight and narrow. So we'll see now tomorrow. He looks, uh, he looks game. I'm game as well. That's going to make for an exciting fight. Um, but he missed weight by a lot and I'm going to punish him for that, definitely. You know, we talked about the win streak. Surely, maybe a win tomorrow night. You're in the title mix now, for sure. What's your message to Pitbull? Do you want to get in the mix straight after this one? Maybe one more? I'd like to get one more in. There's a show on in Wembley there in, uh, in, uh, in, in London on uh, September, the 14th of September. I wouldn't mind getting on that and uh and then see him but I, you know I, I'm, I'm open to whatever they want to do you know what i mean so we'll see but i'll just focusing on this fight at the minute i don't want to think too far ahead i have a tough lad in front of me now tomorrow so uh yeah gonna be well prepared for him and take him out and then see what's next when you look at the fighters on the rest of the card you look at sinead kavanagh overcome so much in her life to get to where she is today then you look at Young Nate the Great. It's it's easy to get you guys mixed up based on your names, Nate yeah. and Nathan Kelly. Yeah. Young Nate the Great is the next generation coming through, inspired by yourself, Conor McGregor, all those guys. It's not difficult to draw inspiration from those around you on this card, is it? Uh, definitely not. No, you know, and just just I just think being a part of uh, such a professional organization is enough to inspire inspire me personally. But uh, being uh, like Nate's my teammate, Derek Kelly's my teammate, Sinead's my teammate. You know, Paul Hughes is fighting as well. You know, we have a good Irish, an Irish back in here now where we're, we're all pumped, we're all ready to go and perform in front of our home, our home audience. And, uh, you know, just that alone in itself is really, really uh, motivating. And, uh, you know, this is going to be my fourth time competing in the arena. Uh, so, in my career so far. So, you know, I'm looking forward to uh, getting stuck in and giving the fans what they want, which is a good bit of violence. The crowd here at the Three Arena is renowned for being one of the very best on yeah. the planet. How much of an edge does that give you and your opponent? This is this is just coming into enemy territory and then some, isn't it? It's something that very, very few people have experienced. Yeah, you know, fortunately for me, I'm on the good side of the crowd uh, <laughs> and I have people cheering for me. It's very hostile if you're if you're on the, uh, the way end of the crowd. I've been there before myself. Even though you might not think much into it, it is, you do feel a certain way about it. Um, but yeah, I, I, I can guarantee that, that I'm going to be fired up from that crowd. All my, my family, my friends and my fans coming to watch me, you know, it, it inspires me. It, it makes me want to perform for them. So uh, you can best believe I'm going to bring it to the best of my ability tomorrow. And like I said, I don't know, this could be my last one here for, in this arena for a while, I don't know. So, uh, you know, if it is the case, I'm going to bring a, a heap of violence. I'm going to look to put this lad away inside two rounds and make everyone's night worthwhile for, for paying money to come and see me, definitely. Amazing. Excited to see you back in there. Best Thank of you luck. very much.